Hello, Professor Liu. Want to teach you how to do your first same lab project. It is your World Lab 2021 version, Module One, same project One A. When you click on、uh, the link, it will take you to, and you click on the link to open the new browser. And your new browser will allow you to download a instruction file, and also a startup file, and supported file. This is a word file. You do not have solution file. When you complete it, downloading, you supposed to have your、uh, your first name, last name underscore one, and Your instruction file and your support file, and、uh, instructor also have、um, have a、um, instructor's in,、uh, professor Liu's instruction. You should download this file. So we are ready to do this work right now. All right, we're going to continue to teach you how to do this work. Before we started. You should open、uh, Professor Liu's instruction. So you use this instruction to help you to start with. And so number one, it tell you that is your first file, and you should save as this file to underscore two. So we open this file. The file is open then. And as soon as we open the file, you should say. File save as, and same folder. <clears throat> Then make sure you do underscore two. All right. So the file is saved. All right. So we are going to base it use the use these uh. Instruction to teach you how to do this work. So number one, it tell you that、uh, you work in the financial aid department of every university, and you are creating a flyer to advertise upcoming financial aid workshops. So we are going to do this. First, we are going to begin by making the, you know, the theme to be uh, the uh, office theme. So you are going to follow that one. We change the document theme to office, and here is instructor tell you. You go design tab, and when you choose the theme here, you pick office. You scroll all the up in office. All right. So that's step one. Step two say the theme color. Okay. So the color is changed to red. Okay, you should change to red. All right. After that, we say this. So that's two. We change to to red, right? And next, we are going to change our margin. All right. So we're going to see the margin is in the layout. All right. In the margin, you're going to change to narrow. Okay. We haven't finished yet. Then next. We are going to、uh, make the picture, so we are continue to do this right now. Okay, we are going to continue on step three. Make make the picture of the students、uh, more eye catching, eye catching, and suitable for the layout as following. So we're going to change the size, and we're going to change、uh, have a picture style. So we have to select on the picture, and you will see the picture format of the two words are here. The first thing is we're going to change the height to two point five. You don't need to change the width; it will automatically changed as soon as you change that. And we are going to do this right now.、Uh, we are going to make the shadow center shadow. So this is in the picture style. You're going to select the picture style. And look for the shadow, and let me see. That will be this one. Center shadow rectangle. 
So you select uh, the picture style. We got picture style right now, and we are going to select a picture effect. The picture effect we select glow, and we want to go to uh, brown. <coughs> Uh, five point brown, so that's coming to here will be glow five point brown as in color six. Now, at this moment, if you do not have this option, you use the wrong word version. We are using 2021. You need to come to college to do this. All right, let's continue. Step four, and we are going to draw attention to the five. Uh, to the headline. The headline is financial, so we can click on this. And uh, we are going to make the headline say financial and aid workshop. And we want to draw attention to do that. So, number one, you are going to click on this one. Mm. Click this one. Okay. At this moment, the better is click on the character point. All right, uh, hidden character symbol. Let's click on that. Then I will want this um, to change this. So I'm going to go to the layout group. Layout group. So once I get a layout group, I want the before to 12. Okay. And the after to 6. So this is more eye catching. That's A. All right, that's A is 12 before 12 and B is after 6. And C, we're going to change this to all uppercase. And this, you need to go back to the home group. And the home group right there at the phone, home tab and the phone. And there is a uh, phone group. You want to change this uppercase. So it's called all uppercase right now. And that's this mean same time we're going to change this to size 28 all right so finish this one right now this step four we continue to step five we are going to copy the every university from the heading paragraph right here at top here we're going to copy this and uh, you're going to say control c and you're going to paste it at here that, and so if you click on the uh uh this display the hidden character uh, hidden symbol is easier for you you're going to write here and you're going to do control v okay so now uh you are you copy this and to this line right now okay then we are continue to do this then next we are going to uh, we do that Monday, uh, November 8th. That's an important day. So I want to bold it. All right. So that will be step six. You bold that to stand out. And number seven. And we wanted to do this. We want to do uh, Monday. Uh, we want to bold it. Monday, November 8th, all the way to uh, November 19th. That's important. So we select these two and we want that to be bullet to stand down. So the step seven, I create a bullet list beginning with the paragraph Monday, November and uh, end up with uh, uh, 4 p.m. Okay. And let's go to step eight. We are going to go to here, say the workshop. <coughs> Right here. So uh, we're going to add words. Okay. So the workshop, uh, <clears throat> the workshop present. Let's go to it. The workshop present. And we come and click here. And we're going to add uh, requested, requesting the guideline. Okay. So we add this right now. And we complete step A. All right. We want to make sure uh, people know something important so we want to say the long the long often okay okay so the long often with interest we want to people know that so we put italic 
to make people understand that. So we do step nine. Step ten. We want to delete a job usually available on campus. So we want to delete that, <coughs> including the point. Oh no! When we delete that, make sure we delete here. Okay, delete it. All right. So we finish that. Then we're going to go to、uh, step eleven.、Uh, Emphasize、uh, the workshop leads. Okay, from the paragraph beginning from the grant. So I start from the grant <coughs> from here, and、uh, to the paragraph beginning with work study. Okay, so all these. All right. So we want to emphasize that, and so. We are going to change this to the font style to a、uh, trebuchet. So you type treb. Okay. So we got trebuchet already. Ah,、uh, then we want to tre trebuchet. Okay. Then we got that. <coughs> then we are going to go to the font color. At the font color here, and we want to change to dark red. S N one darker twenty five. So we change to、uh, select here. Make sure this is correct right now. We select this, and here, okay. So it's dark red. <clears throat> SM one, darker twenty five percent. So it's really fifth column, fifth row, okay. All right, so we made this stand out right now. Okay, so next we're going to、uh, draw attention to web address right here, and in the paragraph completing financial aid guideline. So we're going to see this, fixing this right now. So first of all, we're going to select these, just the, just the, uh, uh, the link, and right click it. And I want you remove the hyperlink. So we remove the hyperlink right now, and we're going to make it、uh, a little bit stand out. So right here, we are going to select this. All right. So once we once we select that, and we are going to go to our uh test uh. Uh, we are going to、uh, go to your、uh, text effect. So we're going to select this. Then we are going to go to text. So、uh, number twelve. After we remove、uh, the hyperlink, then we are going to make stand now. So we select this. Once we select this, we want to add some uh text uh effect. So we go to here the font and go to the outline, outline. Then you change choose the color and we want this color uh to be orange. So orange. Okay, and we want to orange accent too. So this is orange accent too. All right. So once we select that and we done for the effect, it does make it stand out right now. Next, we are going to do step thirteen. We're going to format the entire line for this. So we select、uh, complete the financial aid guideline are available at this、uh, website. We select this right now. We want make it to be the center, all right. So we are going to back to a home, and we make this to be the center. So this is center center right right now. And next, ah,、uh, we are going to have the paragraph shading dark red. <clears throat> so these we are going to go to the paragraph group on the paragraph group right there, and we have a shading. Shading here, on the shading here, 
we are choosing dark red accent one. Uh, so this is dark red accent one, lighter eighty percent. All right, so we complete this step right now. So, uh, that's good. Now complete this step. So don't have the actual thing right here. Now we coming to the next step right now will be step 14 we are going to insert a picture so right here oh, sorry step 14 we are going to insert a picture to the following uh graph right here so here we do insert a picture and the picture is from your own drive you save it and uh, I am going to go to my thing. All right, so this is the picture. All right, as soon as you uh, see that this picture. All right, so that's you select this picture already and you want to resize this to one okay and you resize this to one and the picture also need to be centered so you come in back to home and you center this picture now we finish this part right now next thing we need to do is we're going to add outline for this picture so you are going to uh go to the you just add outline so uh we can uh select this right now so this you know make this um uh, hidden character um uh, function disappear now we're going to uh finish the flyer with uh outline all right so you go to design tab design tab add the design tab here then you going to select the um, page border add the border here we choose the second one dotted one is the second one and the second one here uh we are going to change the color it's brown accent five so All right, brown S and five is the color we selected, and the width is one one point five. Once you select it, now you have a dotted border line right now. Uh, now you save it. Then you upload it to see your point. We complete this project right now.